Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. If you're a beginner wig wearer or just interested in trying wigs but you don't know what to do and it seems like so much work, or if you're looking for a wig that you could throw on and go, I have the perfect wig for you. This is my first wig and it's extremely beginner friendly. So if you're interested in learning more, keep watching. So this is what the wig looks like straight out the package. As you can see, this it's short and tapered on one side. It's an asymmetrical cut, short in the back with a side part. However, the construction of the wig is very solid. As you will see, there's a lot of lace part in space um, on this wig cap, so you're free to part wherever you would like. It comes with two combs on the side, one comb in the back, as well as an elastic band to adjust to your head size. So as you can see, the wig already comes pre-plucked. So not much customization is needed. I'm going to go ahead and just pluck a little bit more just to customize it to my liking. If you'd like to see a more detailed video on plucking your hairline, um, I do have a video showing how to customize a wig and that has everything from bleaching the knot to plucking the hairline as well as I also have a video on tinting the lace. I'll be sure to link those videos up top as well as have it listed in the description box down below and at the end of this video. So guys, this is what the back of the hair looks like straight out the box. I went ahead and curled this hair while it was on um, the mannequin head since I can't see my hair in the back and it's a lot easier. I didn't do anything too spectacular. As you can see, I just simply bumped the ends with the flat iron and this is what the back of the hair looked like when I was now finished. Now I'm ready to install the wig. So I'm going to just go ahead and put this on. Make sure it's pulled down on both sides. And I'm going to take this clip in the back and just tuck it in. And this is the front. I think I plucked enough. It looks pretty natural. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this lace off. And I want to cut it really close because I'm going to glue it. So I'm not going to leave too much lace on. And if this is easier for you, you could do it off your head. But since I do this all the time, I'm fine with cutting it while wearing it. And I just kind of move the scissor back and forth so it has some zigzag motion and it's not exactly a straight cut. Look at that. You see that? Not even glue it down yet. So this is what it's looking like and as you know I haven't tinted the lace, I haven't applied any foundation to the lace um, or bleached the lace. This is basically a stock wig. The only thing I did as you saw was just do a little bit of customizations to the hairline um, and it's already looking really natural to have had nothing done to it. I didn't even part it. This is the part it came with and look at that. It's perfect I don't even have to mess with it so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm um, apply the glue um, this is the new glue if you want more information about this glue make sure you check out the um, my latest video I'll be sure to link that up top as well as have that at the end of this video so I'm going to just apply some of this glue to the hairline 
and it dries really fast. This is what it looks without me doing barely anything to it. Literally just bumping the bag, cutting the lace, and gluing it down. So, but I want to um, lay this down here just so it could be a little bit more sleek and straight. And as I decide what I want to do with this side. of these flyaways I'm going to use this flyaway tamer and I'm going to go ahead and add some powder just to fill in over here all right the face powder I normally use I'm out so let's hope this one works Hey doll, so I ran out of my normal face powder and this powder just did not work. It's entirely too red. Um, it really prevented this install from being flawless like it could have, which is why I did not apply it to the part as well. And this don't really match my skin, so I'm gonna just leave that. I'm just gonna lay a little bit of baby hair on the side. So I did go ahead and clean my perimeter. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of my Eco Styler Gel and I'm gonna take this little baby hair thing and I don't want a lot of baby hair I just want enough to cover the lace so I'm gonna pull down a little so what I'm gonna do instead of curling this side over here I want it to have more of like an edgy look so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to add some mousse so I'm gonna use this lot of body mousse that I have you can use any mousse So guys, I was just playing around with different ways to style this hair. As you can see, it just kind of like easily adjusts into a style. This wig is, I'm really feeling this wig. I am not even going to lie. So guys, if you want more information about this wig, I'll be sure to have everything listed in the description box down below. And if you have any questions, as always, don't hesitate to ask me. Um, you know, I love talking to you guys. Um, and let me know what your thoughts are about this wig. Are you feeling this? Are you feeling sure here on me? What do you think? I've been thinking about cutting my hair now. So just let me know how you like this or not. Is this something that you would be interested in rocking? Um, and if so, what other ways would you wear it? Because remember, I'm still trying to 
come up with the perfect perfect haircut before I go ahead and get the big chop. I'm looking for an edgy style. So if you have any suggestions, please go ahead and let me know. I'll leave it in the comment section down below. And if you found this video helpful or if you just enjoyed it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and make sure you hit that subscribe button along with that notification bell so that you'll be alerted every time I launch a new video. I got new videos coming every week, every Sunday. Make sure you be on the lookout for that. Guys, I really appreciate you watching. And as always in part in, you guys stay blessed. And I will see you in my next video. Take care now. Bye. <laughs>